we're back on our space station that we knocked the bottom out of on the last episode and fell to our death. This episode, that's not going to happen because I'm going to be smart about it and I'm going to let Eddie do all the digging. Oh! Yeah, there you go. So, I guess you guys are probably already wondering uh, what all you've done because you can see things are different. All I did was I put our rocket on top of the space station there and... Um, I moved uh, the chest over here. I got a couple of extra chests and stuff, and yeah, whatever. I had to rebuild basically everything, so I went on and got us a parachute. I got our oxygen mask. I got our oxygen bubbles and everything, so we even got extras, so that's good. So we're going to get on, and we're going to get started. We're going to build our oxygen producer up here because we don't want to be using our oxygen tanks while on the space station. Yeah! Yeah. Also, guys, if you do enjoy the video, please don't forget to slap that like button. I'd greatly appreciate it, and it'd be freaking amazing. You guys are fantastic, and I love you to death. I love you so much. Without further ado, let's uh, let's get this let's get this party started. We need to go out here. We're gonna need to build a um, we're gonna need to build a tree farm, which shouldn't be too hard. We'll build it out here, and once we have our tree farm, we'll build our bubble factory thingy, and the bubbles will be amazing. Okay. Actually, I don't need this much dirt. Uh, we just need a little bit of dirt. So what I'm going to do is we'll just put this down like this. And we'll put the dirt over there. Like right over there. And then we will shear the leaves off the trees and everything will be good. All right, there we go. Okay, let's go grab us some saplings. So we're going to need the saplings. And we're going to need the bone meal and the shears. There we go. All right, I think I should be able to make an axe out of this. And that'll be great. That'll be, that'll be awesome. Perfect, and it has magnetism on it. There we go. Okay, so we'll plant our birch tree here. We'll hit it with a couple of bone mills. And then we will shear off all the leaves. All right, that's probably going to be enough leaves. We'll try it, all right? So what we got to do now is we'll get the wood. Okay, we put one log here, one log here, and one log here. And then we put the... We need the, the oxygen collectors. We'll need the oxygen collectors. So these things here, we'll have to move them back here. And we will put them underneath the tree. Okay, now all we have to do is we surround the oxygen collectors with our, uh, with, with our leaves. And they will produce... Uh, yeah, they'll start producing stuff from this. I've got to be honest, this jumping this high is kind of annoying. All right, perfect. So there we go. Those will collect the oxygen. Now all we got to do is hook them up with some power, and we're going to need to hook them up with uh, oxygen and some of these. There we go. And then we will have our space station completed, and we will be able to travel to the moon uh, from here, and that'll be good. The next question really is where are we going to uh, where are we going to put our solar panels? I'm thinking we're gonna have to put our solar panels off to the side or something, maybe over in this vicinity over here. I think that's what I'll do. I'll just build this out and we'll add our solar panels out here somewhere so that they can always have you know enough sunlight and such. All right, so I went on and I hooked up our bubble distributor and it cut on, so I kind of didn't get to do like a grand turn on. So there it goes. The bubble machine is now on. I don't know if it's going to fully enclose us or not. Hopefully so, but we'll see. As you can... All right, come on, a little bit farther. A little bit farther. We've almost fully enclosed the space station. Let's see. Um, no. Looks like we're going to miss the corners. But this is perfect. It got the majority of the space station. So now the majority of our space station is included in the bubble uh, producing machine. So now we do have a space station. We do. And it does have bubbles. And it is keeping us alive. We love it. It's going to be beautiful. Now we just need to keep going and add a little bit. We got to make it a little bit bigger. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make this thing a little bit bigger. We are now out of heavy wire. Uh, we're going to have to go back and get some heavy wire from Earth. Uh, we do need to go check on our uh, moon base and then we need to make preparations to go to mars don't forget mars is where we're headed actually we're trying to get back to our home planet don't forget crashed is all because we crash landed on a strange world now we've come back from the brink of uh of annihilation we're we're now off the planet uh we're actually back in space we just need to get a little bit farther once we're on mars we'll be able to make a rocket that will send us to our destination which is uh back to S S starfleet headquarters 
There we go. We'll make some stairs so I don't have to keep jumping because jumping is sending me into flight mode. If we put the stairs right here, it should be good, I think. There we go. Boom. Run right up there. Boom. That works. Cool. All right. So I'm grabbing all the materials for pickaxes and we're about to make our... Uh, next bit of travel, we're going to go on and head to, where is it, the, to Mars, or sorry, not to Mars, we're going to head on back to our main base in the, uh, on the moon, this base, we can now stop here safely and not have any problems, which is exactly what we wanted to do. Now we're going to continue. Look at this. It looks, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. Now we're going to head to the moon and we're going to go to work on that base. We needed uh, more pickaxes and stuff, which is why we left to begin with. So now we're good. Right at it. We're good. <laughs> yeah, whatever you say, Eddie, you little freak. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we'll be making our descent. As you can see, we are about 500 blocks up. We're going to start putting on the brakes now. Please hold on to your drink. Put your your, your food trays upright so they don't end up in your face and you're suing the airline. Thank you for flying Lancy Poo Moon Express. There you go. First commercial uh, drops on the moon. All right, we are uh, now on the moon, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to head over to our base, which should be right here. There we go. Um, and there we go. We're now, we have now uh, dropped down. We're inside the base, closing the door, waiting for an airtight seal, and we will be good to go. Let's double check, see if we're good. Checking, and we are sealed. We are good. And there you go. We're back on the moon. Our base is looking like a baller status. Okay. Little Mar the Martian's going to come out and be like, how's it going? I'm going to be like, it's fine. Thanks for asking. Let's see. What do we need to do? Let's walk outside and we're going to figure out what all needs to be done. We could go uh, on a little bit of an expedition. Been a little while since we went on an expedition. There's still a lot of things we can find out here in the middle of the moon. Okay, let me see. There I brought food back. I know I did. There we go. We got some baked beans. The base looks good. We got our solar panels up and running. I'm going to go over to that village and we're going to... Uh, uh, I wonder if villages are the only thing. Let's do a little bit of exploring around. I'm, we've got... Let's see where our air tanks are. We're good on air for a while. What is this? A fallen meteorite. Let's take it. I just got a raw me meteorite... Muriotic me ore. Okay, let's see. I don't know if we can use these mere, these this ore for anything, but if we can, then that's good. I don't know what we can use it for, though. I really don't. I'm kind of thinking, what should we... What can we do with this stuff? Let's see. Let's just type it in and see what it comes up with. So, raw... All right, it can make, we can make it into throwable chunks. We can make it into ingots, and then the ingots can be used to make sensor glasses. Uh, all right, apparently we can make meteorites into throwable meteorites that we can then hit people in the face with. That's always an interesting way to go about it. So we could farm those if we really wanted to. I think we should come over here and search this village. Remember, we were here earlier, and there was nothing here. Maybe steal some of their supplies, like the bottom of their, their house. Like, look, the 10 decorative blocks right here these blocks are nice i think we should take them these these could go well for us there we go we're kind of uh you know how we're we're, we're just industrial people and we're just trying to find um uh we, we are a corporation that is harvesting the life forms on the moon because this is what we should do i just thought about it you know what we don't have on the moon we don't have water we should bring some water up here and introduce water to these little people these these fellas we are exploring we have not found anything at this time there is no sign of another village that can be raided all right i do see some kind of space flowers over here i repeat i do see some space flower looking thingies over here we're gonna go over there we're gonna snatch up these flowers we'll take them back and we'll grow them in our scientific lab that's probably what we should work on making a scientific lab i'm not gonna lie let's see what do we got here we've got some uh we got some blue balls blue balls we got some blue balls all right cool i see a dungeon off the starboard bow okay but i do see a village over here all right we'll be right back guys <laughs> 